I think maybe I'd rather have that than almost anything. I wish your father could have read this film. He'd have liked it. He'd have liked this. Driving away from the inn, I knew all about every man or woman who'd been told the job was filled when it wasn't. Every youngster who'd ever been turned down by a college or a summer camp. I knew the rage that pitches through you when you see your own child shaken and dazed. From that moment, I saw an unending attack by adults on kids of seven and eight and ten and twelve. On adolescent boys and girls trying to get a job or an education or into medical school. And I knew that they had somehow known it too. They, those patient, stubborn men who argued and wrote and fought and came up with the Constitution and the Bill of Rights. They knew that the tree is known by its fruit and that injustice corrupts the tree. That its fruit withers and shrivels and falls at last to that dark ground of history where other great hopes have rotted and died. For equality and freedom remain still the only choice for wholeness and soundness in a man or in a nation. Your father would have liked to have you say that, Phil. Well, enough of us realize it, Ma. Time's getting short. Not enough people and the time's running out. <laughs> 